It is a complicated right. subject. And the thing is, is AI is so prevalent in our lives right now. It is everywhere. You know, it's in your cars. I mean, it's been around for a long time. Right. It's just, it's just like you said, advanced to a whole different extreme. It started with little traffic lights when it sequences. That's yeah. sort of like an AI, isn't it? So, I mean, it's rare everywhere. And we talk about it and everybody's saying, oh, yeah, it's great, it's great, it's great. But which is, however, we do have to be protected from these things as well. Just like the internet, the black web and things like the dark web, sorry, all things like this. Right. It's, it's all part of it. So I don't Most people it. don't know that when you're driving your car, that the manufacturer, <laughs> if you've got a new car, the manufacturer is collecting all that information. 100%. And, and um, may use that information, may sell that information yep. to insurance companies to, yep. right. Uh, and it, it's important that we allow for research but it's also important that we protect our own privacy. So if, for example, where I travel, if, if that's used to figure out you know, models for safe driving, that's one thing. If right. that's used to, for example, you know, figure out you know, how often I go to the grocery store, that's not so good. No. Right. And, and I'll be honest, um, I think it's, it's part of a military background. But when I'm driving my electric car, I do wonder now and again is imagine a quick terrorist attack. You could just close down everybody. You'd log in and you could close all these cars down.